Hey guys, Synergy here, and I'm bringing you yet another brand new gameplay. This one's going to be an attrition gameplay, guys. It's 118 points, and we're going to get into it. So you can see basically the loadouts that I'm going to be using in a second. I've actually got the Urban Renewal card. Now, a lot of people do underestimate this card, but basically the more Spectrus you kill, uh, obviously the quicker you will get your Titan. Now, in the maps, there is quite a lot of Spectrus as well. Excuse me for a minute. <coughs> <clears throat> okay, I had a bit of a frog in my throat there. Right, so we are moving on and basically all I'm going to do is I'm going to take out these constricted grunts. So somebody's actually using a constricted grunt card, which is absolutely a bad decision to do in attrition. Because basically you rack up your points by killing things after each other. For example, grunts, spectres, pilots, as well as titan kills. Right, so you can see I actually get taken out by a pilot there that forces me to bring in my first pole rank burn cap. Now my pole rank is basically going to take time from Titan 4 and you can see my Titan ready already. Just having a little scout around because I do know somebody is around here. There he is in the corner, okay. And we'll take him out. Now we know there's another guy and there we go, we're taking him out as well. And we just finish up with the pistol kill there. So we get into our Titan and we're going to start to roll. Okay, teams are getting pretty even at the minute. <coughs> and you can see me pick up a kill with the arc and the kill look. Right, so all I'm doing at the moment is I'm utilising the minimap and finding out where all those grunts, where all those spectres are spawning. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take them out little by little, for example like so. And then I'm going to take out random packs like so, you can see the time 6 on the attrition points there. And what I'm going to do is keep moving around. Now, the thing is with pilots in this, you'll find a lot of them inside buildings, hence why I clustered up there. Because I'm pretty sure that's where the pilot was, but he's obviously moved into this window. Unfortunately, he did get a hit on me though, so I don't pick up this kill here, um, because he's seen me already. Just checking the other window, seeing if we can get eyes on him enough. But unfortunately he's long gone, so he disappeared. So I completely ignore that, and what I do is I go back onto the guns and spectres, and I'm just going to time with it. Uh, 85 points to 36, and you can see I'm just going to rack these points up as fast as possible. Uh, now, my team, uh, we're playing attrition at the minute, so we're basically hunting everything as well. I'm the only one with the Titan up, but I used the cluster missile over there, and um, I was hoping that the Titan came back, and he actually did. Okay, unfortunately, he's got a bit of a better position on me, so I need to uh, get the hell away from there right now. And you can see my teammate picking up the flat there, and the boss monster's going to attack him, so I'm going to give him some extra support, and there we go, we'll take the Titan out. Teamwork for the win. Injecting pilot to keep the team up there. I actually missed that one, so I decided to get over to Boss Monster just in case he tries to roll him. Of which Boss, I think, actually took him out. Right, so we've got a two on two Titan situation at the minute. There we go, one of them has just been eliminated and got crushed by Grimm's auto Titan. Nicely placed over Grimm. Okay. Titan's attacking me and we got two right behind him and I'm just going to go in for the punch unfortunately he ends up with a nuke jet just making sure I don't get taken out by that uh, God knows how I completely failed that miss but we're just going to punch him in the face anyway he's in the orb and this Titan eventually gets taken out well, he was going to get taken out by the time, so I just decided to Titan punch him, leave that Titan on the ground. Almost get crushed though, that was bloody close. <laughs> I've never been crushed, not in the history of Titanfall, it's not fair. I'm not allowed to get crushed. Okay, so you can see the rodeo is actually going for his Titan now. Why Hyadine's just got the new projection and he actually picks up the auto titan kill. I end up stepping on the pilot that was around there. You can see that pilot in the mode. There we go, we end up picking up double kills and we end up getting the mayhem achievement and rampage. Another one. 
So human pilot got taken out again, and we're going to keep those points rolling as much as possible. There's a pack at the back there, but chances are we're reset back to one point. Yep, yeah, one, two, three. And we're just going to find out where these pilots are, where everyone's hanging around, and we're going to move into the game. Almost halfway through, guys. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you do like my videos. Big Bulls has just used a constriction card, or whoever that boss guy is. I really don't know why he's using constriction. I mean, surely he must have played. Looking at his rank, he must have played attrition before, so uh, yeah, it's just complete idiotic. <laughs> Obviously, that's going to give your team less points to get. Sure, the guns are going to fight for you, but they're going to fight for you, and you've got less points to get. Simple as that. Hence why we're on 252 and they're on 91. So we actually go into the rodeo here. I know he was in the smoke. Just going to help our team out and get from the left. Obviously that titan's been taken out, so I'm just gonna come over here. I'm trying to figure out where all these packs are hiding, and they actually get hit marked there. That allows me to find that human pilot there, Blacky Bars, the one who used the conscription cap. These spectres are really annoying just to shoot, so I decided to drop kick them. Unfortunately there was a human behind them who ends up taking me out, which is Sonny Black. We got our titan fall ready to rumble again. I actually lose my way on this map, um, I keep forgetting where to go and stuff like that. Um, obviously I will learn the map as time goes on, but you can see the net attrition points, I'm not doing too bad. 281 points, I'm just going to attack this Titan here, he's going to add some random damage. This one's an auto Titan, I'm just going to go in, punch him, and again, and again. There we go. Cut him down and eliminated. 295 points. Last Titan to go. There we go. Get the shot on him. That brings us up to 300 points and that gives us the victory again. So, what we're going to do now is we're going to move on to the dropship evacuation. Now, you'll find that the dropship evacuation on this map is in one of two locations. The one where you can see on the map at the minute. The other one is directly in front of me, exactly where a shot where that pilot was jumping over there. Another pilot hitting the Titan, so he's actually going to go through the backside, which is exactly where our team is covering. I end up picking up yet another kill there on KU's visual. Another human kill as well, so Ed Wheels, that's number three. And we actually get the achievement for all the kills that all teams. Buttons. When that happens, you don't even need to destroy the dropship. Peace out.